Hey guys, it's Vanessa. I am here today to do a video about the Clinique Pep Start skincare system. Um, I picked up this system maybe like a little over a month ago um, in like the sample sizes at Sephora. So I've been using it for a bit and now I have a review for you. So we'll get started. The system has one, two, three, four products that I know of. Um, and like I said, all the ones that I have are not full size. They are sample sizes that are available at Sephora. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is the two-in-one exfoliating cleanser and it comes in a pink little container like this and you can see it has like the little pep start situation um and this exfoliator is really good let's see if it says anything specific about it that I should tell you no not really but it has like a really nice um exfol like you can feel it exfoliating but it's not like really harsh and like big kind of like um I don't know, like the apricot scrub or that feels like it's literally like glass ripping you. This one is really subtle. So they're just really nice, like micro buffing um, action that you get. And I, my skin always looks really, really good after I use this. There is a, a kind of like drugstore or I should say more alternative or more affordable alternative to this. And it, I would say it's the um, Queen Helene Mint Julep Scrub. So they're very similar to me where they have like that same kind of there's a grip, but it's very fine, and it really does a great job at polishing and resurfacing your skin. I only use this about once a week, sometimes even like once every two weeks. Um, I personally don't think it's good to exfoliate all the time. You kind of want your um, uh, cells to regenerate on your skin and give it a little bit of time, and then, you know, start sloughing off the dead ones like every now and then so that the new um, skin can resurface, if you will. So I don't do it all the time or else you'll just be like rubbing your skin raw and it could cause more problems than good. But this I really, really like. The next thing is the quick cleansing swipes. So the interesting thing about this is that these towelettes are the travel size, but they come in like just your standard like makeup wipe kind of pouch that we're all used to if you buy the full size. But the travel ones are like really interesting. You get nine of them in this container. And I think I showed this before in a haul, but... I'll do it again. It's fine. Um, it looks like this. And as you can see, it says push to start. So what you do is you put it on a flat surface and you push down. And what that does is it releases the towelette into the liquid that is originally they're separated. And as the towelette absorbs the liquid, it lifts up. And then you could just kind of take it out and unroll it and use it. So this wipe is a pretty good size. It'll do your whole face with one wipe. Um, they're always moist because the, the liquid is separated from it. So it's like you're always getting it at its most uh, hydrated, if that makes sense. But you can see it's very gauzy, like very see through -y. So when I first saw that, I was like, oh, am I going to like this? But they actually do a really good job at taking off makeup. And I really, really like them. Um, and I think I, somebody had told me that the the... Full size wipes are very similar because I thought maybe they wouldn't be because of the packaging, but they said that they're similar and they work really well. So I like these. I love the travel actually more than the bigger one. This would get more expensive to keep buying, but I just like those. I pop one in my makeup bag at all times and then I have a couple at work. They're great for travel because they're like, you know, you can't really spill with them. The towels don't dry out because of the kind of separation. So at first I thought this was gimmicky, but I am obsessed with these and I love these. And even if you have like other face wipes, I would recommend getting this. Um, like I said, for those specific reasons, just having it in your purse, um, you know, for nights when you're out, like, and you need to clean up your makeup because you're starting to look like a hot mess. It's cool to have one of these. So the cleansing products I love. The next product is probably my favorite product in the whole line. And it's the Pepstar Hydro Blur Moisturizer. And it comes in this cute little blue container like so and I don't know if you'll be able to see this but it has like this kind of pinkish tint cream in it now this is bomb I'm wearing it now I have no makeup on my face except um these skincare products and I love this stuff it hydrates your skin really nicely um I have like combination to normal skin I would say um if I use like too heavy of a uh, moisturizer I will get greasy in my forehead and I will um, break out a lot I'm currently have a few breakouts but don't blame these products for it it's because 
my boys in blue, the Cubs won the World Series. Oh my God. But anyways, the Cubs won the World Series. So postseason baseball has destroyed my skin because all I have been doing is like going out with my friends to watch games and eat really bad food. So that is why I'm breaking out. But otherwise, this stuff is so good. It really hydrates your skin. It leaves it nice, but it also has the hydro blurring. So it kind of fills in the pores and it feels a lot like, well, let's see if I can dig this out. Yeah, um, if you've ever tried this like L'Oreal Studio Secrets Magic Perfecting Base, it's almost as if someone just took this and added a moisturizer to it. It's the same kind of feeling as like a silicone based primer. So you get that smoothing effect. And I think it really works. Like when I use this, people always think I have like a BB cream or something on, but it's just this bad boy. So I am a super fan of this. I will definitely get the full size once I run out of this guy. And the last product is the Pep Start Eye Cream, and it comes in this fun little uh, tube. This is this one is full size, I will say. Um, I like this. The thing with me is I'm so inconsistent with eye creams. So when I am consistent, I do like this. I do have a lot of fine lines, and you can see them like I haven't been using it for a week. And like I said, I've been going out like literally every day to watch the Cubs. But... Um, I'll, I'll start noticing my under my eyes looking a little crepier, so I'll pop this bad boy on, and I like it. I also really like it because it um, it feels cooling and hydrating, so I like that about it. I love um, eye creams that have this because it really just helps you apply it. So what you do is you put um, pull up the tip, and then you just squeeze out like a little bit. And so like the one thing that people complain about this is I'm gonna so squirt the camera. Look, when you push this down, it like. <laughs> It like jizzes on you. So like what I do is I just kind of like aim it on my face on one eye and then I just squeeze out some for the other eye. And then that way you're not really wasting products. I don't think it's a big deal, but I know a lot of people on the Sephora website were like complaining about that. And they were like, ugh, it wastes that little bit of product every time. That's like one application. So I just say aim it to your face, give you a little hydrating facial. But yeah, it really hydrates um, the eye area. I don't really have dark circles. I haven't seen a difference with that. I don't think eye creams really help with dark circles. So anyone that says that, don't believe it. It just says uh, hydrates, brightens, and perks you up. So I would say two out of three, and I like it. Overall, I love this line. I really recommend it. Like I said, the best thing about it for me is that at Sephora, you have the opportunity to pick them up. This is in the travel section. It's about $10 for nine of the wipes. This one, I forgot how much it costs, but also in that travel section. And I think, I believe, yes, these two come together as a sample, um, which is cool. And then this guy is a full size, but you can buy it in the travel section and it comes with uh, an eyeliner or a mascara. So you might as well get it there instead of buying the full size and just getting this. You'll get a little extra product. So let me know down below if you have tried the pep start system do you like it what skincare are you using right now are you a cubs fan and if you're not get the hell off my page all right love you guys bye <laughs>